And we are going to be live any second now. We're live. Awesome. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to the channel. I know it has been <clears throat> just, uh, I think it's been just over a week since the last time I streamed. And uh, I'm sorry about that. I thought I was going to be able to stream at least once during this past week. Uh, but finals kind of took a little bit more studying than I thought it was going to. Um, so there was no streams last week, and I'm sorry about that. But we <clears throat> do have some updates I need to let you guys know about here on the channel. I'm going to be streaming a little bit more frequently uh, over the summer just because I won't have to worry about a lot of stuff with school. Um, I may try and stream like a couple more days during the week, maybe like four days a week instead of three. <laughs> Which is what I usually do, and I'm gonna have to switch some of the times around uh, just because of my work schedule and stuff. Because uh, I got some lawns to mow and I got some driveways to power wash. Uh, and people are already sending in some messages to uh, get their reservations in. Um, I bought an Oculus Quest 2, which I have been playing. It came in like a couple days ago, I think it came on a Thursday afternoon. Uh, I have had a blast with it so far it's an amazing 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 headset and I played uh, super hot VR on it great game uh, drunken bar fight simulator again great game and I'm gonna try and figure out some way to stream it but something tells me I won't be able to stream VR games until I get a new graphics card because I don't think that the old 550 Ti is going to be able to handle <laughs> VR games because I mean I ran the uh, the Steam VR uh, like performance test thing and then it pretty much said everything else in your system is fine you got an i7 you got you know, everything else is fine but why are you putting a 550 Ti in this system and uh, yeah it's that's the one thing that's holding me back and I'm just hoping hoping and praying that this GPU shortage uh, <laughs> kind of ends at some point so I can finally get my hands on a GPU yeah late night exam stream yeah no we didn't do any of that last week um, because I did have exams but exams are over <laughs> I took my physics final and I probably uh, failed but um can my computer run Bioshock? Yeah, it's the old one, not the remastered one. I've got both of them. Uh, the remastered run, um, remastered one requires a, uh, I think it was like a GT 670 or something. But um, this one requires, um, yeah. <laughs> For this one, you gotta have an NVIDIA 6600, which is like several generations before the 550 Ti. So it'll be fine for this. <laughs> but yeah, we're done with school. We got graduation practices this week. And then uh, we have graduation on Friday. So it's finally over. I will get it pulled up. And then we will be good to go. I just got to <laughs> agree to some terms and conditions from this old game. Accept the agreement. Yeah, this happens a lot with new games that I'll buy. Uh, <laughs> it'll have some old, old system that you have to go through and kind of download some other additional files in order for it to run. Uh, but it'll be fine. It might just take a minute. Oh, I have a new monitor the new primary monitor because the previous one that I was using was the one from my dad's system but the uh, G27Q came in from Gigabyte it's a 27 inch screen uh, it can handle 1440p and uh, 144 hertz refresh rate but I can't enjoy all of those uh, wonderful features again graphics card too slow <laughs> alright it's almost done Installing DirectXR, which I've never heard of. I've heard of DirectX, but 
hopefully we will be able to play this game soon. <laughs> oh, you guys want a funny story? You see that? Hold on. You see that thing right there? Yeah. That's a picture that I stole from school. <laughs> it was in uh, our communications teacher's room. And he's got a bunch of, like, quotes that he has on the wall. And so me and a couple other guys decided, you know what? I need some inspiration. Let, let's let's take some quotes. All right, I will get this pulled up. Uh-oh. Bioshock is not having a good time right now. Hold on. Nvidia. Can I alt tab out of this? Okay. Let's try and fix this. I can go to gameplay now, right? Surely. Thank you. Let's go down here to game capture. What is going on? What just happened? I have no idea what just happened. <clears throat> but I think Bioshock might have just tried to crash my computer. Yeah, no, I'm gonna have to force quit Bioshock. Hold on. Let's pull up task manager. End task. Let's try it again. Maybe it'll work this time. It's in a very, very weird, uh, like resolution. And I don't know why. I like it when that lady whispers NVIDIA in my ear. Okay. Am I going to be able to play the game? I have no idea what is going on because the game isn't pulling up or I mean it's pulling up and I can hear it but that's about it okay Okay, it's I see a guide instantly that's that's here that's a, a startup fix. Um, okay. So I guess we're not gonna be playing that game. Because it won't start up and I gotta work on it and get some other programs to uh to fix that. So let's find another game to play instead. You guys want to play Getting Over It with Bennett Foddy? Because I do. You added another... Oh, no. Alright, hold on. I'll get this switched. Here. 
Is it gonna be under Windows because it doesn't recognize this? Don't know where it is. Oh. How about now? Can we try it now? Bioshock isn't even running. Why is it saying that? Hold on. Netflix is also not running. Why is it showing Netflix? <sighs> Maybe now I can get it to work. Hold on. Let's try and go back and then go back again and maybe now it'll be there. Getting over it. Okay. We got it now. Finally. That took way, way, way too long. This is weird. All right. Come on, dude. Can we? Yeah, baby. Oh, come on. There's no feeling more intense than starting over. If you deleted your homework the day dude. before it was due, as I have, or if you left your wallet at home and you have to go back after spending an hour in the commute. Oh if wait, you there's other music playing. Pause that stupid Spotify royalty-free stuff. All right. I quit the game. There's no feeling more intense than starting over. If you deleted your homework the day before it was due, as I no. have, or if you left your wallet at home and you have to go back after spending an hour in the commute, if you won some money at the casino and then put all your winnings on red but it came up black, if you got your best shirt no. dry cleaned before a wedding and then immediately dropped food, no. if you won an argument with a friend and then later discovered that they just returned to their original view, starting over is harder than starting up. If you're not ready for that, like if you've already had a bad day, then what you're about to go through might be too much. Feel free to go away. I've actually had a pretty good day. I'll be here. Mm. That was a pretty sick jump, though. All right. Thanks for coming with me on this trip. I'll Bennett understand Foddy. if you have to take a break at any point. Just find a safe place to stop and quit the game. And don't worry. I'll save your progress, always. Even your mistakes. This game is a homage to a free game that came out in 2002, titled Sexy Hiking. I think that's just that a, Jazz a VHS of me hiking. Czech designer who was known at the time as the father of B-games. And B-games are rough assemblages of found objects. Designers slap them together very quickly and freely. And they're often too rough and unfriendly to gain much of a following. They're built more for the joy of building them than as polished products. Come on. Oh no. Hmm. Oh, you just lost a lot of progress. I didn't lose that a lot of progress. I real punch I planned that. I'm 
I'm just getting my core workout in. I don't know what you're talking about, Bennett Foddy. Oh. Ah. Come on. Get yourself over that. And then down. And then up. Ooh, no. Okay. All right. Okay, okay, Bennett. Okay, Bennett. Mr. Bennett Foddy. No, how about you go back down and then fling yourself up. Okay, no, not like that. Okay. And then fling yourself up. Oh. Oh. No. Okay, get yourself back up there. Just don't listen to Mr. Bennett Foddy, okay? He's just trying to get inside of your head. In a certain way, sexy hiking is the perfect embodiment of a B game. It's built almost entirely out of found and recycled parts, and it's one of the most unusual and unfriendly games of its time. In it, your task is simply to drag yourself up a mountain with a hammer. And that act of climbing, in the digital world or in real life, has certain essential properties that give the game its flavor. No! No amount of forward progress is guaranteed. Some cliffs are too sheer or too slippery. And the player is constantly, unremittingly, in danger of falling and losing everything. I wonder if I can find sexy hiking. I may play that after this game. Oh, come on. Why don't you go around that way? No. 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 No! Come on. Come on, and now fling yourself up. Fling yourself up. Fling yourself up. Anyway, when you start sexy hiking, you're standing next to this dead tree that blocks the way to the entire rest of the game. It might take you an hour to get over that tree. And a lot of people never got past it. You prod and you poke at it, exploring no! your reach and your strength, trying to find a way up and over. And there's a sense of truth in that lack of compromise. Most obstacles in video game worlds are fake. You can be completely confident in your ability to get through them once you have the correct method or the correct equipment or just by spending enough time. In that sense, every pixelated obstacle in sexy hiking is real. Eighteen minutes in. Okay. All right. Come on. Wh Reggie. Reggie, come on, man. Oof. Sorry about Reggie. That. No. I'm going to call this guy Reggie now. <laughs> Reggie. Get yourself up this mountain. Nope, Reggie. Get up there. Nope. Reginald. Come on, buddy. Look, we're friends. We're friends. It's all right. It's all right. All right. Now let's get you pulled up there. And now pull yourself a little closer. <clears throat> Come on. And then just up. Like that. And then just whoop. Just like that, dude. Mm. No, no. The obstacles in sexy hiking are unyielding, 
and that makes the game uniquely frustrating. But I'm not sure Jazuo intended to make a frustrating game. The frustration is just essential to the act of climbing, and it's authentic to the process of building a game about climbing. A funny thing happened to me as I was building this mountain. I'd have an idea for a new obstacle, and I'd build it, test it, and it would usually turn out to be unreasonably hard. But I couldn't bring myself to make it easier. It already felt like my inability to get past the new obstacle was my fault as a player rather than as a builder. Imaginary mountains build themselves from our efforts to climb them, and it's our repeated attempts to reach the summit that turns those mountains into something real. Come on. When Come you're building on, a video game world, you're building with ideas. And that can be like working with quickset cement. You mold your ideas oh. into a certain shape that can be played with, and in the process of playing with them, they begin to harden and set until they're immutable, like rock. And at that point, you can't change the world. Not without breaking it into pieces and starting fresh with new ideas. No. Nope. That, that's very, very prophetic, buddy. Mm. No! You get back up there. No, not... Get up there. <clears throat> Come on. Come on. No. No, 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 no. Oh, it happened again. Keep on trying. Don't let it get to you. Do you see me laughing? Do you think this is funny, Bennett? I'm not laughing, Bennett. Is this some kind of joke to you? Huh? Is this how you get your sick kicks? Of watching other people suffer? Huh? Playing your stupid game that is an homage to sexy hiking? The hit B game? Where you drag yourself up a mountain with a hammer? Sometimes drag yourself down a mountain with a hammer. Come on. Come on. Get it. All right, come on. No. All right, all right. This thing that we call failure is not the falling down but the staying down. Mary Pickford. It's not the falling down, but it's the staying down. Actually, you know what? That is, that's actually very prophetic, Mary Pickford. Because last night, I watched a movie called Cool Hand Luke. It was a very good movie. It was about a guy who, even though he got knocked down, he always got back up. I recommend you guys watch it. It's a, it was a very good movie. Like, really. What? Come on. What? What? Oh! What? Come on! Just bring it out just a little bit and down and then throw me up. Yeah, nope. 
down and then throw me up. Uh, yeah, yeet me up there. Nope. <coughs> throw me up there. No. Come on. <coughs> Come on. <coughs> Don't get angry. As a wise man once said, it is only when a fly lands on your testicles to when you realize that there is always a solution that does not involve violence. Mahatma Gandhi. We're in the same position that we started in. <sighs> Gaming time, baby. Come on, bring me just a little bit closer to that. Come on, flip it over. You could not have made this any easier, could you, Bennett? This game, so easy. I do believe a five-year-old could have played this. Nope, 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 nope. Bennett, you thought you could fool me right there? I know you, you are like an open book to me. Your game is not hard, is not difficult at all. Come on, come on. Don't don't go down the mountain. Nope. You gotta go up the mountain, son. Come on. What? That is not up the mountain. You've done this part before. You know it's possible. Just do what you did the first time. I will kill you. You don't ever t talk to me like that, Bennett. Bennett Foddy. Oh. I'm just kidding, Bennett. I like your game. It's a good game. You want to tell me why you're moving? My hand is not on the mouse. <clears throat> Get me back up there. Let me at him. No. <clears throat> Come on. No. I huh okay hold on um, I I I I I no no don't quit continue I'm so happy there's an auto save.
I've gotten up this part before. I just need to do what I did the first time. Just like Bennett said. Right, Bennett? Because this part is so easy, right, Bennett? Can you stop grunting like that, dude? Thank you. Can you go back up the mountain, dude? Thank you. No. The soul would have no rainbow had the eyes no tears. John Vance Cheney. Thanks, John Vance Cheney. That was very inspirational. Now, can you give me like a ladder? Yeah, thanks for the Starbucks cup. Litterer. You would like to litter Bennett. Isn't that right, you litterer? Come on. Now just launch yourself up there. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, just like before. And then launch yourself up there. And now, no. You gotta bring yourself over here. Lower yourself down and boom! Spaceman! Come on. It's just better to just do that. Yeah? You like that, Bennett Foddy, huh? You like that? There's this other game that I need to play. I've been seeing on TikTok and stuff. It's like Escape the... Not Anunnaki, but Escape the something. And it's like, it's got like a microphone detection thing. What? And so it'll detect your microphone if you're saying something. Am I stuck? No, I'm not stuck. Come on. Come on, just pull yourself up. And then just down. And then lift off. Oh. Okay. Okay, buddy. This is real simple. Lift off. For years now, people have been predicting that games would soon be made out of prefabricated objects, bought in a store, and assembled into a world. We and for the most part, that hasn't happened. Are so good at this game. Because the objects in the stores are trash. We cannot be beat. I don't Actually, mean they look bad or that they're badly made, although a lot of them are. I mean they're trash in the way that food becomes trash as soon as you put it. We in are the so. Things okay. are made to be consumed and used in a certain context, and once the moment is gone, they transform into garbage. In the context of technology, those moments pass by in seconds. Hmm. Very, very interesting thoughts. Now back to what I was saying. We are so good at gaming. Here on the Ziggity channel, if you are watching, you are a pro gamer. And I want you to be proud of that. Because you watch my stream. And I got to this point in the game. We're not done yet, but we're close, er, to being done with this game. <coughs> I wonder who has the the most time on this. It's definitely not going to be me because I'm super good at this game. Get over there. 
Uh, no. I have a feeling like I am going to get sent off of the edge at some point. Get a loop back around, all right? Uh. Come on. It's not that hard. Over time, we've poured more and more oh. refuse into this vast digital landfill that we call the internet. It now vastly outnumbers and outweighs the things that are fresh and untainted and unused. When everything around us is cultural trash, trash becomes the new medium the lingua franca of the digital age. And you can build culture out of trash, but only trash culture. Be games, be movies, be music, be philosophy. I just fell from all the way up there. I'm not gonna get mad. I'm not gonna get mad. We, we don't get angry. It's just a game. It's just a game. It's just... It's just a game! Why you have to be mad? It's just a game. It's kind of hard to just envision this as just being a game when Bennett Foddy is giving me life lessons on not giving up in a game that makes you want to give up. Not just on the game. Oh, no. Don't give me that stupid, oh no. You did it to yourself. It wasn't me. I'm not the one in control. You are. You're the one that's swinging the hammer. Oh, oh but you're the one that's swinging the hammer for me with your mouth. I don't want to hear it, dude. That's just another excuse for you being bad at hiking this mountain. I'm just, I'm sitting here watching. I'm not even moving the mouse. I, I'm not even touching this. I I have a Wii controller in my hand right now. I, there's no way I could be operating. I'm I'm playing VR. See, look at my headset. I'm not even I'm not even watching you hike. All right, we're back here. No! No. We're going to be calm about this. Because we are gamers. We do not get angry. Peace is our language. I am about to commit a war crime. Bring yourself over there.
Sounds like a Sprite commercial or something. We are so good at this game. We are so unbelievably good at this game. Alright. Go down and then go up. No. Go down. And then go up. Yep. Yeah, no. Alright. Go down. And then go up. No. Come on. We're cool. We're chill. We're we're just playing a video game. This is just a game. Just come on. You've done it before. Just do it again. I am running out of mouse pad space. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. No. You better not. No. The pain I feel now is the happiness I had before. That's the deal. I am about to make Lewis. the Geneva Convention look like an autobiography. Hmm. Uh. 42 minutes into the stream. It feels like I've been here for four days. Ah. Oh. Oh. Gamer mm. moment. Oh, gamer moment, gamer moment. No, no. I feel within me a peace above all earthly dignities, a still and quiet conscience. Gamer moment, gamer moment. Gamer moment. You cannot now believe that you will ever feel better. But this is not true. You're sure to be happy again. And knowing this, truly believing it, will make you less miserable now. Abraham Lincoln. Hit self with hammer. Hit self with hammer. Hit self with hammer. Please. Please. Wait, did I ever change the name? Oh, no. I didn't. Yeah, I need to change that. <laughs> Getting over it. All right, yeah, update that. <coughs> I'm going to see if I can figure out the Bioshock patch thing, and then I might stream that tomorrow. Because I didn't give you guys a stream on Friday because my buddy from Oklahoma was here. Shout out my boy Topher. Thanks for coming over. It was fun. All right, come on. If you need to take a break, it's okay. I've saved your progress. Shut up. I don't need to take a break. I'm streaming right now, Bennett. You wouldn't know anything about streaming because you're a... You probably don't even have a Twitch... Twitch.tv slash Bennett Foddy. <coughs> I actually don't know if he does or not. He might. Stop it. This is how it's going to work. We're going to take this and we're going to launch ourselves. <clears throat> and we're going to 
Bring ourselves up the mountain. Because we are good at this game, no matter what anybody says. Get back up there. You're not allowed to leave. Come on. I just dream of getting back up there to that spot I was earlier before I knocked myself all the way back down. slowly and gently bring yourself to this point and then launch yourself let's go baby we are so good at this game do not all right I think I figured out the strategy for this just hold it straight up okay Maybe this is what digital culture is. A monstrous mountain of trash, the ash heap of creativity's fountain. A landfill with everything we ever thought of in it. Grand, infinite, and unsorted. No! Okay, that's not that bad. I was actually about to have my heart broken. If I had fallen all of that way down to the very beginning. Nope. Come on. As long as I don't just shove myself out into oblivion, I'll be fine. I don't even remember how I got up there the first time. My hands are so sweaty. Oh, I gotta wipe them on my shorts for a second. The vertical wall here has a way of getting it harder the more times you try it. I think anger makes you swing the hammer harder, and that can push you away from the wall. No, I am I am overjoyed that I am back at this point. No, 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 no. I'm going to go get some water. I'm, I'm going to get some water. No, I'm not getting water. I'm not going to give up that easily. I'm no quitter.
50 minutes in. All right, come on, get up there. Get up there, please. I'm gonna kill you. Just gently, okay? We're gonna use our brain here, okay? That's not what we call using our brain. That's called. Oh! Whoop! I just if I just put it right here and then just yank it, huh? What if I just yank it? Yank it. Yank it. Yank it. No, you are not going to. <laughs> Hello, mm -hmm. Beal Pock Bock. How's your night going? Mm. My night is going awful because actually it was going great until I started playing this game. We were originally going to play Bioshock tonight, but uh, Bioshock for some reason didn't want to start. And apparently there's some bug. Uh, that I have to get sorted out, and that's kind of common, but oh well. But yeah, welcome to the stream. Ah. Come on. You're gonna make it, dude. I know you can. Just the light is right there. Please. For the love of your hammer. <clears throat> oh. oh. We're back. We're back. <sighs> Tune bit 56. Hi. Welcome to the uh to the channel. How was your night going? Control R equals zoom. I have a feeling like that's going to make me restart. Ooh, baby. Come on. made it to another section of this map. I'm so excited. I feel like that's a gap right there. It's meant to look like there's something there. Oh, no, I was wrong. There's 3D models of breakfast. Gen X's fanfic novels. Scan magazines. Green screen Shia LaBeouf. Banned snuff scenes on Live League. 
Facebook's got lifelike bots with unbranded adverts and candid shots of Kanye and Taylor Swift mashups, car crash epic failed GIFs, Russian dashcam vids, discussions of McRibs, discarded, forgotten, unrecycled, muddled, rotten, untitled. Everything's oh. fresh for about six seconds until some newer thing beckons and we hit refresh. And there's years of persevering, disappearing into the pile, out of style, out of sight. Bennett, that oh. was actually a beautiful poem. Thank you for that. <sighs> no. No. You're gonna get back up there. Oh! Okay, come on. Bring yourself back up there. Bring yourself closer. Okay. Bring yourself closer. In this context, it's tempting to make friendly content that's gentle, that lets you churn through it, but not earn it. No. Why make something demanding if it just gets piled up in the landfill, filed in with the bland things? I don't think that actually goes anywhere. Does this go somewhere over here? Come on. Come oh. on, please. Do not stand at my grave and cry. I am not there. I did not die. Mary Fry. Even her name rhymed with that poem. That was nice. Thank you, Mary Fry. I will remember that you did not die. <coughs> Come on, please. Okay. Mary Fry, Mary Fry, as I go up the water slide. To live is to suffer. To survive is to find no, some No, to play this to game is to suffer. Oh no. Friedrich Nietzsche. You know what? Thanks Friedrich Nietzsche. Nietzsche. What however? No, nah, Friedrich Nacho. I don't care. Thanks for that word. Those words of wisdom. Because this game is to suffer, not life. But technically, I guess while living, I'm choosing to use my life, or waste it, actually, by playing this game. Just so I entertain you guys. So you guys should be grateful, okay? Thank me. I am your new master. I have s subjected myself to this torture for your entertainment, for your amusement. You ought to be ashamed Life of yourself. Life is a mosaic for of this. pleasure and pain. Grief is an interval between two moments of joy. Peace is the interlude between two wars. You have no rose without a thorn. The diligent picker will avoid the pricks and gather the flower. Satya Sai Baba. Oh yeah, I'll tell you who's a prick. Oh. Alright, come on. Come on. Oh, that was about to be bad. Oh, we just passed the hour mark. All right, I'd like to take this time really quick. Hold on. Take this time really quick and uh, say, Tombit56, women, folks, and yellow MR99. Thank you guys for watching so far. Um, those of you guys that have been watching that are following me, thank you for following and thank you for watching it. It is a big encouragement to me doing these streams and... Uh, it does help me grow here on the channel. Those of you guys that are watching and are not following, I really appreciate the follow. It not only helps me keep uh, the channel here growing, um, but it also does help you guys keep up with the channel. So, I mean, it's, it's a win-win situation because I know you wouldn't want to miss one of my streams. Uh, and I'm also going to be doing kind of a small charity stream 
when I hit 50 followers. Um, just because it's it's a way that I can give back in just some small way to the fortune that you guys have given to me. So thank you guys for watching, regardless of if you're following or not. All right. Come on, dude. It's just a piece of metal. No. No. Yes. No. Yes. Ooh. No. Yes. 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 No. Yes. Ooh. No. What other games do I play? Uh, I play pretty much whatever I can get my hands on. We've played everything on this channel from Amnesia to Donkey, or Ted Donkey Game, which was a browser game. That was a terrible, terrible, terrible stream. I hated that stream so much because that game was borderline unplayable. Yeah, we played Amnesia, Soma. Uh, we played some kind of cheaper, small developer games here on the channel. Um, don't want to shout myself out too much, but the uh, my other streams are posted over there on my YouTube channel. It's linked in my um, my about page. Hopefully, when I get another graphics card, that's not this 550 Ti in this machine. It's from 2012, or not my machine, but like because everything else in this computer is new except for the graphics card because you can't find any <coughs> graphics cards out there now. But hopefully when I get a new graphics card, I can do some more stuff. I'd really like to do some uh, maybe CSGO Surf stuff. Because I know that's kind of an older uh, genre, but I still love going on Surf servers. Like, that's one of my favorite things to do when I first started playing PC games, was to go on Surf servers and talk with people. That was a whole lot of fun. Alright, we're back up here. This is my favorite part of the game, actually, so far. My least favorite part has been that stupid iron bar. Come on. No. That's okay. At least we're not back down at the entire bottom. Like we were about five minutes ago. Come on. Please. <laughs> Bro. Just let me get up this wall. <clears throat> I'm gonna have to go on President Kennedy on you and say, Mr. Gorbachev, tear down this wall. Was that Kennedy that said that or was that Reagan? I don't know, for the sake of the joke, I'm gonna say it was Kennedy. I'm so happy I'm done with high school. This last year was awful. Like, it just seemed like it would never end. Okay, come on. Alright, now just bring yourself down. No. Put yourself down. Okay. Now take the hammer. Put it over there. Yeah, I know. I, I kind of figured that out. I was like, I saw that. He was like, Control R equals zoom. And I was like, hmm, I don't think so. I have a feeling like I'm going to hit Control R and it's going to uh, restart the game. Come on. But yeah, thanks for the warning, Terra938. I appreciate the trolling, but come on, please. No. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're still good. At least we're still up here. At least we're not back down at the very beginning, 
Where if you throw yourself off of this wall, that's where it sends you. No problem, I'm helping people. You're doing the Lord's work, Tara. Keep it up. Come on, man. Please. Yeah, just just put yourself down right there. Nope, that didn't work. But maybe I could just maybe just quickly get that over there and Yeah, baby. Was way too close. <clears throat> Wait, so what other games do you play? Um, I play GTA 5, CSGO. Uh, I would like to play Doom Eternal because I got that game. Um, but I can't play it yet because, again, graphics card isn't strong enough, so I'm waiting to get another graphics card. Um, there's a whole lot of games in my library that I want to play that I just haven't gotten the chance to. Oh, actually, I got an idea. I'll just read out the, the games on my list to you that I'm, I want to play. Halo the Master Chief Collection is by far my favorite game. Amnesia the Dark Descent. We've played that here on the channel before. Among Us. Oh, Ziggity is sus now. Before Your Eyes, which is a game that I really want to play here on stream. It's a game where it like kind of tracks your eyes, and it progresses through the story based on how you blink. Bioshock, which is what we were going to play here on the stream. CSGO, getting over it with Bennett Foddy, which is what we're running now. Uh, Darkwood, Darkwood was fun. We played that on the channel a couple times, but apparently it's like a 60-hour long campaign, so we kind of stopped streaming it about a month ago. Uh, Fallout 3, 4, and Fallout New Vegas. Firewatch, which, that was a fun game. If I, if I were to recommend you to go watch one stream of mine on my YouTube channel, it would be the Firewatch stream. I think that was about maybe three weeks ago? Maybe? I don't know. It's probably more than that. GTA 5, Human Fall Flat, Kerbal Space Program, uh, Perfect Vermin was one that we were going to play around the channel, but again, graphics card not strong enough. Resident Evil 7, graphics card's not strong enough. Rising Storm 2, uh, that's not a game I would play on stream, no. A Short Hike, which was recommended to me by Nickel98. Um, so if you guys have any games that you want me to play, there is a recommendations box, um, or like a suggestions box, somewhere on my Twitch page, like in the About section, uh, where you can put games that you want to see me play. Um, but yeah, Nickel98 recommended A Short Hike, so thank you for that. Civ 6. Sid Meier's Civ 6, which I want to play on stream at some point. Soma, which we played. Spooky's Jump Scare Mansion, which is what we've played already. Uh, Super Hot, which I'm going to try and play when I can figure out a way to actually stream VR games. Because I can't use this PC because of the graphics card, again. Uh, Terraria, which I made a promise to somebody that the first time, or when I get my new graphics card, that'll be the first stream I do with that new uh, card. Titanfall, Titanfall 2, Rainbow Six Siege, Trackmania 2, Unturned. And then the game that was literally the start of uh, my streaming career, Waifu's Spooky Space Station, which was an amazing game. Uh, there was some free game I got ye the other day called We Went Back, which I might play at some point. And then Worms, Weapons of Mass Destruction. Yeah, so... If you ever wanted to know uh, what were some of the more interesting games in my Steam library, there's a couple other ones in here that I just didn't name because they were just games that I didn't. I'm probably not gonna play on stream. Like the Back Rooms game, free edition, uh, Depth Six, uh, 
Mind's Eye, Lakeview Valley. Like some of these games were, were kind of fun, but they were really games that you would just play for like 30 minutes and then realize, well, that, that was worth a dollar, maybe. <laughs> but yeah. I'm kind of excited for uh, all of the games I'm going to be able to stream when I get a new graphics oh. card. Oh. I say when. <clears throat> I probably shouldn't be that hopeful. <clears throat> oh, please don't do that. Oh. Come on. <clears throat> no, do not. That's what I'm talking about. Get back up there. Get back up there. No. Uh. It's okay. We're just grilling with Bennett Foddy. No. No. Come on, please. I can't grab onto Sorrow that kid's head. Yard, where the new grass flames oh. as it has flamed often before, but not with the cold fire that closes around me this oh. year. William Carlos Williams. Thanks, William Carlos Williams. It's a cool first name and also a cooler last name. I like the name William. Hey, Zig Zig. Hello, Woofstick. Are you going to be streaming any uh, Minecraft soon? Get over there. Oh, no. We're good. We didn't even fall that far. You just you just thought I was going to fall that far. No. Woo! Oh. Come on. Let's get up there. What was that? I think somebody just... Oh, hey, Toonbit56. Thank you so much for following me. I think somebody just punched my window. So... I'm gonna be right back. Follow me if you don't want to get... If you don't want Ziggity to die. So, yeah. Good luck, Charm. I'm gonna go get my bat and see if anybody's outside.
Cody is here. Uh, Jack, <laughs> I am streaming right now. Hello. Well, I know you guys are streaming. You know. <laughs> What's up? This guy's hey. PC build is garbage. Everybody say hello. Hello. Hi. Zane is touch starved. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, these are my friends, and they showed up at my house for some reason while I was streaming. Were you guys, did, did you punch my window? Yes. yes. That was you? Yeah. Okay, because I, I, I was, all right, I got a phone call and two messages, but my phone, okay, you guys should probably know that my phone is like permanently on do not disturb. No. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So there's a picture of through my blinds right over there. So this is strange. I know that picture. Yeah, I know. I, I talked about it on stream earlier, how I stole it from uh from Coach Druby's room. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Hey, put that back. <laughs> He's gonna steal stuff from my room. <laughs> okay. All right. I don't need my phone anyways. All right. See ya. Are y'all just leaving now? Hmm. Here, let me see it. I'll t I'll tell you the password. Okay. All right. Well, I guess I'll be getting my phone back later. Jack, it's not, the amp's not turned on. You know where the switch is? It's, no, it, it's, that's just a light. The switch is behind it. It's underneath the, the overdrive pedal. We will be back momentarily. Here, look. Alright, see you later, Toombit. Thank you for coming and tuning into the stream. This is a uh, not standard protocol, but uh, protocol. yeah, yeah. No, this just gets edited out in the edited out in the final cut. But yeah, thank you for watching, Toombit.
There was no morning sweatshirt that I wanted you to wear. There was, but no, not you. not a bullet casing. That is a light switch. Those are bullet casings. Point <laughs> <laughs> at the bullet casings first. Okay, well, I thought he was pointing at the light <laughs> switch no, that you were holding. Yeah, no, 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 no. Okay. It's connected to a USB. Stream on your phone. Stream labs on your phone. Well, I would have to download Stream Labs on my phone. What? I, I hate Stream Labs on my phone. Zane doesn't, isn't dedicated to the stream. He doesn't love his viewers. Okay, Nickel Jack. 98, he hates you. No, that is not true. Jack is spreading lies. Nickel 98 is my biggest fan. He's been to almost every single stream. I guess I'm going to end the stream there because uh, everybody is here. Well, yeah, I got like another like 35 minutes to go left of streaming. So if if I'm going to do my, huh? Yeah, but the graphics card can't run at that high probably. <laughs> so I can. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, I will see you guys uh, tomorrow on the next stream. I will try and figure out a way to fix Bioshock, and then we'll probably play that. So I will see you guys tomorrow. Goodbye.